and that you look like a greased scalp, you know? So basically the whole point is, I ain't doing anything. The whole point is I'm trying, is this the right one? I don't want to Y'all probably like, why am I so close to the camera? But you guys, today is makeup day. The, you can see all in the light and stuff. But today is a makeup day. We're gonna practice together. Like I said, I wanna try and start doing my makeup a little bit better. And this setup was really hard and it's like after midnight. I wasn't gonna do this video, but I was like, you know what? Everybody's sleeping, so why the F not? So we're just gonna play in makeup and see what we get. Maybe it just looks better with a ring light. So let's just go ahead and get started. So girls, bring your tools, let's do this together. This is not a makeup one-on-one -on -one session. Well, I guess it is. We're gonna learn together and do what we can with the face. I might even look good. Don't worry, I'm gonna still give your hair up that video because this is so fun. I moisturized earlier, so please, if you haven't, go ahead and moisturize. My skin looks like butter, baby, so I'm good. First thing I'm gonna use is primer. You can use any primer that you want. I got this from my local beauty supply. You see, this is um, an oil primer. I've never used it before, and I've seen people use it a lot, so I'm like, you know, let me just go ahead and try it. Just gonna. And those of you that usually do your makeup on camera, what do you do? Because my camera is, my phone is here, my ring light, then it's my desk with my makeup, and then it's my big mirror. And I just feel all kinds of confused as how this is supposed to work. Anyway, let me know in the comments below, but maybe I should just probably just Google that myself. I'm gonna go on YouTube for myself and find that out. Okay, this is oil. Can't nobody just do their makeup on their phone, you know? I am not Jackie Aina or Susu. I'm not none of them. Or adiola. Okay. So far, y'all, the storage on my phone keeps like messing up. And I just literally got this phone. Why well, just get what? Well, yeah, I just I got it last month before I went to Mexico. And I don't understand. I don't know what I need to delete. I've deleted things. And I don't know. Okay. Now that you look like a greased scalp. You know? Gonna go ahead and apply your foundation. The foundation I'm gonna be using is where is it? <laughs> be using two foundations. I'm gonna be using the NARS. This is my first time ever using NARS because I hear so much about it and I've heard good things. Let me go ahead and use my next total control. Use this. Um, I used to use it a lot, but I kind of stopped ever since I bought the NARS. And I also been using my my um, black opal foundation stick. Y'all, black opal is bomb. Mac who? Black Opal, black. you get by it at Walmart. I don't know where they're not selling it at, like Ulta Beauty, but it's actually really bomb. What I'm gonna do is, I thought it came with like a little brush thingy, but it didn't get all that. And then I'm just gonna cover it back. It might not even be enough, but remember, we're using two foundations. Well, at least I am. So basically the whole point is, I ain't doing anything. The whole point is I'm trying, is this the right one? This is the empty one. I don't know where it is. Like I thought there was some in here. This is clearly my old one, but we'll see how this looks before I go and pick it. reasoning for wanting to practice my makeup is because I just feel like I want it to look better, you know? Us females, you know how we do. We always look like the ultimate baddie. I don't think I'm gonna use the NYX foundation. I'm just gonna go ahead and use it. It's giving me total coverage. But anyways, I wanted to do this because like, I just wanna perfect my makeup and obviously practice makes perfect. And I just think it's also like very therapeutic. I've really been like stressed out. I'm being dramatic. I'm not stressed out. I just got a lot going on. So I have this cleanse and it's effing with my moods because these parasites want to eat stuff that I'm not supposed to be eating. And imagine doing a cleanse where you can't eat what you want with a crying child that can't talk English yet. Lord. I go sleep and you know, it's not a big deal, but at the same time, I'm like, let me just do this because my best friend does this for therapy, even though she hasn't done it in a while. Get it together, sis. 
Okay, foundation, I see you. I'm be mad if this makeup looks out. It looks really bomb and I don't have nowhere to go. I have somewhere to go tomorrow and I wanted to film this then, but I feel like on film day, when I have to go somewhere, I just be rushing and it just never works out the way that it should. I usually use the LA Girl Toffee, Toffee, however the hell you say it. And I use that for my concealer. But the other day, well like last week or two weeks ago when I went out, I mixed it with toast. I bought toast because I felt like my under eye was too light. So I'm gonna go ahead and mix that today, but I'm gonna use the NARS concealer in the color, I cannot see this, Walnut. Things is hard because you can't try nothing on now in the stores, so it's just kind of like, why is, what is the point? Like, I think we should just buy the makeup online. There's no specific routine that I'm doing. I'm just trying to perfect, like, the flow of my makeup because I feel like sometimes I'm always rushing and not blending enough. And you're probably like, what the hell is this girl talking about? I did this shit. I was supposed to do my eye, my eyebrows, whatever. Apparently you're not supposed to drag your concealer all the way over there, but I'm doing whatever works for me. Do whatever works for you, the rules. You eventually learn, because I don't know, do you mean this part or like what? Whatever. Now I'm gonna do my brows. <laughs> Coffee, whatever for my under part of my eyebrow. just to do my eyebrows. I'm like, girl, that is not that serious. Make whatever works. The eyebrows don't gotta be perfect. Make them look like sisters, not identical twins. And even identical twins don't look identical. So now that's done, I'm gonna use the same concealer and put it on my eyelids. I'm not doing I'm not doing a eyeshadow look today. Still need to improve that. So don't worry, we're gonna practice eyeshadow, but we're not doing that today. We're just gonna do a regular schmegular you know, nothing on the, nothing on the leads. <laughs> don't know how to contour my nose well or whatever it is that's supposed to be done. So I don't attempt it because I feel like since I'm practicing, I might as well just practice it, right? So now I'm going to use my powder, setting powder. I actually don't like to set the powder. I just like to press it into my skin. This is what I'm using. Oh, my nose looks sick. But I'm gonna tap some and get my brush. This brush I have is the ugliest brush I've ever seen in my life. I'm exaggerating, but like this brush is so ugly. I've had it for a long time, but for some reason, when I set or press in my powder, it looks good, but whatever. <laughs> Another thing, I know that there are different brushes and different things you're supposed to use as far as applying your makeup, but for me, I don't know. I just I've never really invested money in like the perfect brushes, so maybe that's another thing why my makeup, you know, is the way it is, or why I feel like I can't do it because I don't have the proper brushes or I'm not using the proper brushes. But the funny thing is, like, people still tell me my makeup looks good, and 
if y'all knew how shitty my brushes were, y'all be like, girl. So maybe that means I'm just really, I'm just too good. Because if I'm using shitty brushes and my makeup still looks decent, <laughs> then maybe, like, maybe I shouldn't invest in those brushes because I'm gonna kill the game. The game. I'm gonna kill the game, that's what they say. Next, I'm going to use two, two foundation sticks, black opal, I'm gonna use suede mocha, and I'm gonna also use ebony brown. I absolutely love these foundation sticks. They are the best. They are absolutely the best because, ooh. The one that I do need to try is Fenty. I haven't invested in any Fenty products, but this year I'm doing it. I'm gonna just do it. Fenty, you about to be my bestie. Whenever I get my makeup done, give me a soft game because I don't want all that. I'm not trying to look like Bob Risky. I fuck with Bob Risky, but no. That's not my kind of vibe. That's not what I want in my look. So, and I don't really like eyeshadow like that, but I do like a light, like, sometimes eyeshadow is just fun, so it's like, okay, why not just try it? But if they said pick one that you don't have to use for the rest of your life, I'd probably say eyeshadow. makeup looking does y'all look you know decent because if it looks decent then you're doing okay tips from somebody who's not a makeup artist everything blended together literally looks like just foundation to me to me i'm gonna oh my god so i forgot i had this it is the mahogany i haven't even opened this and i was gonna use it to contour next video we're gonna all the things i'm afraid to do i'm gonna do it in the next video like contour my nose cut the crease like all that i just wanted to do like a regular basic just plant the face on that's it next i'm gonna use an eyeliner any eyeliner this is the waterproof matte dip liner from the magic collection okay i used their primer earlier if y'all remember sorry y'all i did my lashes off camera as well as my eyeliner so I'm gonna go ahead and complete the rest of the look and show you guys. I used Teddy from NYX and then I went in with another NYX lip suede and the color I don't know it's a nude color so I used that and um, I'm gonna go ahead and apply some blush so let me just put my phone back I'm using is the same one but Brick House from Bla from Black Radiance, I have this. This is the final look. My phone is being stupid, so I wasn't able to do what I want. I'll be doing more videos like this. The next time I'll do contour on like my nose and cut the crease and all that. I'm too scared, I was too scared. But since this is practice, we're gonna practice. We're gonna get it, you guys. All of us, we all in this again. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give me a thumbs up. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. My hair look bomb, I know it do. Mm. Mm. Check it. Mm. See you guys next time.